Well, good evening or good afternoon here near the dead of winter. We're here in Huntington Beach, California, looking at this very rare classic 1986 Dodge Aries Coupe. And we're here to see if we might be able to get it started. It actually needs very little to be put back on the road. But it is for sale. I believe 600 bucks. your mother was asking. Tell us a little bit about this car. Well, basically, um, we needed a car because we were starting a high school and also college. So uh, our sisters actually drove it mainly. But basically, they used it as a car to uh, get to and from school commuting. Like, we didn't drive it too, too much. It was like a two-mile drive to our school. But other than that, though, we used it a lot. Though, like, so it basically got us through for our entire high school career, I guess you could say. Nice. Did you inherit this from a family member? Um, actually, no. It was our Uncle Thomas. He had a relative who had passed away. And basically, uh, after he had passed away, he just had the car sitting there. So basically, he just gave it to us for around $500. Very cool. And now it's a classic pushing close to 30 <laughs> yeah. Do you know if this is the 2.2 or the 2.5 engine? Uh, not too sure. Sorry about that. They're almost both exactly the same. It's so hard to tell just by looking at it. <laughs> but the VIN number will definitely tell us. And I'm glad to say this camera is actually lighting up the picture, which oh, is good. Nice. So we'll just do a little walk around. So you mentioned this car is having some starting trouble. Yeah, um, uh, I wasn't in it when it first had the trouble. My sister was in it. But it was she was on the highway. Uh, and so it had started smoking a bit, so then she quickly pulled over, turned off the engine and got out just in case because she didn't know what to do. And after that though, it was still, you can still hear it revving, but it just doesn't actually like, start up or kick into gear. And it has been sitting a bit now, so I think the battery might be dead. And that though, we had another guy, he, uh, what you call it, had another battery, so we hooked it up to that. Okay. And still, uh, we'll check it out, we'll check it out. I must say I have the exact same model. It's an 89 Aries Coupe, just like this one, except it's a red interior with bucket seats. Nice. Oh, you have the rare middle console option with the transmission stick on the floor. <laughs> now this is a good car. We'll find the right person for you. 86, so it's been here for about 30 years in the same city, right? Huntington Beach? I'm not too sure about that. I know we've had it here for probably like five, six, maybe seven years. The original years. owner probably had it for a very long time. Though. Yeah. Okay. I know he took excellent records of it too. So he had like every single like modification he ever made, but all of its original parts, except for I think a vacuum tube or two inside the engine we had to replace. Then that though, yeah, it's all still original. Oh, and it's only 92,000 original miles. Oh, yeah. That's like nothing. So whatever's wrong with this car, you know, just fix it and keep driving it. You know, with that little amount of miles, this thing has lots of life left. I think I'm going to save my battery.